Hey. Hey. Can, can you help me figure out what to do about Christina? She's making some really bad decisions, and I, I, I think it could lead to trouble. What kind of trouble? Okay, she showed up at the Haunted Star tonight and tried to come on to Ethan, and, well, it got ugly. How ugly? So tell me, Ethan, where did your good intentions lead you this time? I tried to be nice to Christina, but it's a big mistake. Just how nice were you to Sonny's underage daughter? sure that Ethan was the one who attacked you? Yes, it was Ethan. Why would Ethan beat you? Okay, I found Christina at the Metro Court bar wearing a dress that was way too mature for her age, ordering a drink, and when she walked away, I saw a bruise on her arm that was put there by Ethan. And Christina told you? Yeah, and so did he. What, you confronted him? Yes, I confronted him. And he was a total jerk. He admitted the whole thing. He went as far as to saying that it was her fault and she deserved everything she got. Jason, I swear, I wanted to kick his ass I, right I, there. I wish you would have told me. I would have gone No, with this you. is not about me. We need to worry about Christina. Is she, is she okay? I mean, she's, she's hurt and rejected. Jason, I am partly to blame for this. How? Because I told her a lot a lot, maybe too much, about my past, and I, I just hope that maybe she could learn from my mistakes. I wanted them to be cautionary tales, and then I'm, I'm thinking about it, and, and you know what? Christina admires me, and I think that maybe on some subconscious level, she's trying to follow my footsteps. I went to the haunted store tonight to see Ethan. Did he ask you to come? No. But he's been really nice and paying attention to me. I thought he liked me. So I got dressed up and went to see him. But he got mad and said I was too young. And I embarrassed him. Did he say that? He grabbed me really hard and said, He said that I should stop playing games. And then he made me leave. Were there any witnesses? Your dad was there and a lot of other people. The, the casino was open, everyone saw. She doesn't have to do this right now, does she? No, Can I'm she? okay. Right, just, just take your time, okay? It happened when I went home. Ethan showed up. He was furious and out of control. And he started hitting me. And I begged him to stop, but he just kept hitting and hitting. I thought he cared about me. <laughs> it's okay. Can, can she can she talk about this later? Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. I'll, I'll consider that her, her statement for now. But listen, since Christine is still a minor, I'm going to need to speak to you and son. Just what the hell are you implying? You tell me. I didn't do anything with Christina. Something must have happened, Ethan, or you wouldn't be so prickly with me. Look, she came in here earlier tonight, okay? She pulled some trick to make sure my date wouldn't show up. I was a little pissed, and yes, I could have handled it better. But I told her I didn't want anything to do with her, to leave me alone, and she didn't take it very well. Meaning? Meaning she got upset, okay? She argued, and I finally got her to leave. I felt bad about the whole thing, so I went to her house to try to clear the air, and that's when I found her laying on the floor all beaten up. Was anybody else there? No, not that I saw. I was... I just picked her up and took her straight to the hospital. And how did you get the scratches on your face? Christina did it. It was reflexive. You know, she was barely conscious. I just... I just wish to God that I hadn't gotten involved in any of this. So do I look. <clears throat> your father's last way to Las Vegas. I am going to try to reach him, at least leave a message. Please don't get into any more trouble while I'm gone.
Turn around. Turn around! You beat up my girl? That wasn't me. You calling my little girl a liar? Like you pull the trigger, huh? I guarantee you he isn't gonna lie and say he shot himself. I've seen this coming. I don't see how you could have. I knew Christina had a crush on Ethan. It's been obvious for months. I just thought it was harmless. I thought it was some schoolgirl crush that was just gonna blow over. Okay, but you can't take the blame for that. No, but I have been there, Jason. And maybe that is the problem because I was too busy giving her advice. I kept telling her over and over again that she's gotta keep her self-esteem and have that and not let any man treat her bad. I mean, what if that's the problem? What if she listened and that's why she started focusing on Ethan? Well, you know, Christina is young. She's gonna make some good choices. She's gonna make some bad choices. You can guide her, but you can't make her do something or not do yeah, something. Yeah, okay, maybe. Maybe, but he has broken her heart. And I'm just afraid that it's not gonna end there. What if she starts acting out? I mean, Alexis, she doesn't even realize the kind of pressure that she puts on, on her. I, I don't think anyone can live up to those expectations. And then you have Sunny. She saw Sonny lash out on Claudia at her birthday, and now he's on trial for murder. I know, but Christina knows that Sonny didn't kill Claudia. Hey, what's up? You need to come over to the hospital right away. Christina's been admitted. What happened? She got beat up by Ethan Lovett. Is she She's okay? covered in bruises, Sam. Can you come over right away? Yeah, okay. What happened? Ethan beat Christina up. I should have never left her alone, Jason. Can I get you anything, sweetie? Here, let's see what I look like. <sighs> You're pretty black and blue. You had a big old swollen eye, and uh, you got no broken bones. All the bruises are gonna heal, and I'm gonna get you home as soon as I can. I still can't believe this happened. When I get you home, we can talk and you can tell me anything you want, okay? You must be so disappointed in me. I would never be disappointed in I admit it, Mom. You thought I was better than this. This is not your fault. There is nothing that you could have said or done that would justify this at all. I made a mess of everything. No, you didn't, baby. No one has the right to lay their hands on you. I love you. And together we are gonna get through this, okay? I promise. It'll be okay. What the hell are you doing here, Dante? Well, look, he called me. Figured you might be on your way over here for your own brand of justice. Look, this is all a misunderstanding. I did not hurt Christine. Stop lying! Why would I take you to the hospital? Shut up! Get out of here. Dante, I'm gonna, I'm gonna finish him off right well, now. You know that's not gonna happen. Then you go to the hospital and see your beautiful little sister. He beat her to a pulp like an animal. Stop thinking like a cop for once. Think like a brother. Sonny. Put the gun down. Nope. What's going on? Nope. Christina just ID'd Ethan as her assailant. 